Hello. Can we talk? Like, can we, like, not like Joan Rivers, can we talk, but can we, like, just really talk for just a second? So one of the things that I know happens is a lot of people who are otherwise pretty cool, when they see a camera, when they see a camera like this, or they're on video, or they're doing a live stream, well, it is video, but it's more impromptu, or they're having their photos taken, they're kind of like, kind of like stiff and they're doing everything that they should be doing but they're kind of like stiff right so they, they're not their their own personal aura their own personal uniqueness that really is what's captivating which attracts other people to them goes in the toilet as they say down the drain. So if you're new to me, I am Sharon Aver and I help other talented entrepreneurs who realize all that expertise is not enough to stand out in a crowded market and I'm here to help you step into your own star power and be able to earn your potential if not more so you can live the life that others dream about because nobody wants another anybody everybody wants to be a star and you can they're no different than you and me so that said what happens is a lot of the time if you are talking about something that's not really true to your heart that you don't live and breathe and know in your sleep then you get really nervous and clam up and stiff and get really afraid of being on camera. Like right now, I had no idea what I was gonna do for this video until about 10 seconds ago before I put it on and I'm like, oh dang, the light is amazing. I wanna do one more video. And I'm thinking about what someone asked me the other day, a client was talking to me and they're doing everything. And it's like the poor dear is like doing all these videos but has zero personality. Now I'm not asking you to adopt the personality of someone else. I'm not saying that the person is a total dud. I'm saying that the person's a little like clammed up on the camera. And the way you can get around that, the single best way is like, when I was in school, they called my mother down and they're like, oh, Sharon's so shy and quiet. My mother was like, really? She doesn't shut up in the house. And it's because I was comfortable in the house. I was comfortable just being a little girl in my little world, in my little house. So what happened was in school, I was shy and I was a little nervous and I was quiet and didn't say a word. I took a lot of improv classes at one point. That helped me tremendously to be able to get more confidence. I actually just told my son to take some improv classes because it really helps with your public speaking. It helps with doing just anything really it just really helps and it's fun but not necessarily having an improv class what happens is when you're holding up a camera and you're doing headshots or you're doing videos the one thing that will really help you have more of a personality the one thing that will really help you let loose and be in your best self is confidence is really confidence so it comes from either confidence of knowing what you're talking about if you're doing a video and it's something that you can just extemporaneously speak upon whenever called upon you don't need notes you don't need anything you've had enough training and enough background that you kind of know how to have your intro your few training points your end your call to action whatever it is it just sort of comes naturally to you the other thing is to be able to be very aware of your situation of your setting of the light of where you are of what you're wearing of the visual message you want people to say see because authentic visual storytelling is really really key to making a connection what the way you show up online in a photo people decide if they want you to be you know your proverbial swipe right or swipe left left in a tenth of a second so once they see your photo in one tenth of one second people decide if they like you or not and i can help you with that i really can and if you go over to a AuthenticSuperstar.com, you can join my five day challenge and I'll show you how to set yourself up to be able to have that confidence on camera to get you going that you will be able to let your personality shine. And if you're someone who is just not comfortable being on video, let's say, or having your photo taken, well, that's cool. Then don't set yourself up for trouble. Don't you set yourself up in a really stiff, posy, posy world. Do these videos when it's something fun and you want to show people where you are. Have your photo taken 
and when the light is beautiful and you want to be able to show where you are learn what it is so it's more fun if you have to jump up and down 10 times do jumping jacks go for a walk around the block I don't care what it is get a shot of coffee get a shot of booze whatever it takes you to break the ice to start doing something like this and being your own best self and looking at this phone as a friend that you really like and you're talking to and you're just slightly more animated than you are in real life animated not to the point that you sound a little crazy but animated to the point that you're excited like something just great happened to you and you can't wait to share it you know when that happens when something happens and it's like amazing I can't wait to tell you that's kind of the energy you need to build up before you do this and you kind of manifest it in your head you get the mindset to know that you want to be able to exude on camera right you want to be able to not be a blob and be somebody who's really interesting you want to have a personality people could teach you how to do anything anything under the sun but they can't teach you how to have a personality only you can have that personality and to have it you just need to feel confident about yourself and when you'll feel confident about yourself when you have the training to know how to just not think about it and just do it it becomes instinctual so I hope that helps and I know I can help you more over at AuthenticSuperstar.com so see you there if you enjoy this and you have a friend who you think would enjoy it too share it share it with a friend and don't forget you're watching me on Facebook or actually anywhere on social media put on the notifications so you know the next time I go live okay now I'm gonna show you something is that gorgeous isn't that just gorgeous, right? I had to show you that. It wouldn't be fair not to show you that. Right? It's gorgeous. Anyway, see you later, folks. Bye-bye.